Welcome back to Mechatronics Lab. Today we are going to carry out the next experiment that is, the study of liquid level measurement. The objective of this experiment is to carry out the level measurement of liquids using a capacitive transducer. At the end of this experiment, students will be able to measure the level of conductive or non-conductive liquids using a capacitive transducer. In industry, liquids such as water, chemicals, and solvents are used in various processes. The amount of such liquid stored can be found by measuring the level of the liquid in a container or vessel. The level affects not only the quantity delivered but also pressure and rate of flow in and out of the container. Hence, liquid level measurement becomes essential in various processes. In direct liquid level measurement methods, the level is indicated directly by means of simple mechanical devices whereas, in indirect liquid level measurement methods, the level is converted in a measurable signal using a suitable transducer. The level measurement can be either continuous or point level. Point level measurement indicates when a liquid is present at a certain point whereas, the continuous level measurement indicates the continuous level of the liquid as it rises and falls. Typical direct liquid level measurement methods include dipstick, sight glass, or float and displacer measurement. Commonly used indirect liquid level measurement methods include resistive tapes, ultrasonic sensor, radar, capacitive transducer, or hydrostatic head measurement. Point or continuous liquid level measurement methods contains the following commonly used methods. Liquids used for level measurement can be corrosive, non-corrosive, conductive, or non-conductive. The level measurement setup of conductive liquids consists of a non-conductive tank usually of plastic, glass, or acrylic in nature. Two insulated metal electrodes are placed apart from each other. The liquid used for measurement should be strictly conductive in nature. The two insulated electrodes act as two plates of a capacitor with air and water acting as a dielectric material separating them. The capacitance developed across these two electrodes is represented by the equation shown below. This capacitance is directly proportional to the liquid level in the tank. The level measurement setup of non-conductive liquids consists of a conductive tank usually metallic in nature. A metal electrode is placed inside the tank. The liquid used for measurement should be strictly non-conductive in nature. The metal electrode and the metallic wall of the tank act as two plates of a capacitor with air and water acting as a dielectric material separating them. The capacitance developed across these two electrodes is represented by the equation shown below. This capacitance is directly proportional to the liquid level in the tank.